Jason Seiler is an award-winning artist who has done work for Time Magazine, Rolling Stone, and many other big magazines. He joins us this afternoon to talk about one of his biggest honors out there, the Time Magazine, of course, featuring Pope Francis as the man of the year. Thank you so much, Jason. Mm -hmm. We Thank talked about me. this last week. Last yeah. Thursday, you and I got together. Mm -hmm. When you found out about this big honor, you had just a couple of days to put together this image right here that yeah. we see on the cover of Time Magazine. Yeah. How big of an honor is this for you? Well, to tell you the truth, it's still it's still a, sort of a shock because I mean I never I had no idea this is what I was working on when I was working on it. But I'm I'm super excited and just honored that I was able to do this. Because they told you just to do this, and you were yeah. sworn to secrecy. You couldn't even tell anybody yeah, they, about I, this. I mean, they didn't even tell me that it was the person of the year cover or that it was for sure the cover. I didn't really find out until the next morning when everyone else did. Wow. So sort of. I mean, I, <laughs> I did the work. But that doesn't mean that it's going to be there, and so yeah, I was just as thrilled. I mean, I was what? yes, you know. This of is course. Awesome. Yeah. So Jason, tell us a little bit about your background and what you've done that prepared you for such an honor. Well, I mean, I this is what I do for a living. I draw. I work for magazines weekly. So I um, this job really was no different than any other job. Um, I was super excited that it was time because it was my first cover for Time. Uh, but even if it wasn't the cover, I still going to do what I do and do the best work that I can do. Yeah, yeah. and sure. you said you took some time in trying to search the internet, trying to find a good picture of the Pope that kind of showed him with his mouth closed and, and yeah. a nice little smile, and that's what Time Magazine wanted as well. Yeah, exactly, but it was one of those things I had to make up for the most part. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot of references out there, so um, I just had to be creative and find references of him with his mouth closed from different angles and try to make it work for what I needed. But it's what I do on a regular basis. And you taught yourself how to do this mm -hmm. digitally. Yeah. And mm -hmm. that's why you say you're able to get so many, so much work done. Quickly, quicker. I mean, it still took yeah. me about 70 hours to paint this. Mm -hmm. Seven oh? Seven, yeah, 70. Wow. So it's not like it's a computer, so I just push buttons. I have <laughs> exactly. to, yeah, exactly. I have to draw it and paint it. Uh, you know, it's just way quicker, and um, I can work back and forth quicker with the art director as well, make changes mm -hmm. and that kind of thing. And you told me that you spent the most time on his mouth and in on eyes. his eyes, yeah. and you said the hardest thing were the buttons on his robe oh, there at the, the cross. It wasn't the hardest thing. It was just the thing that took the longest to do is little details like that. Really boring, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's so good, though. So, Jason, do I understand you were also asked to uh, paint another candidate for the cover? Is that right? Yes, I painted Snowden, which is inside. Okay. Which, so I, I painted this first. Um, and then from this, they were like, would you want to do another cover for us? So I thought I was doing two covers, actually. Um, I, didn't, and I didn't know that the Snowden was going to actually be in the magazine as well. So well, do, you, do you suppose they did that because they weren't sure what yeah. their man of the year was just yet I think, anyway? I think they were yeah. sort of, I think he was supposed to be man of the year. And then it, I mean, I don't know. I have Who knows? Been, yeah. yeah. And the interesting <laughs> part of that uh, Snowden picture, Edward, the NSA whistleblower, Edward Snowden whistleblower, um, the interesting part of that picture is that you didn't have anything but a headshot of him and you yeah. used your own, a, a picture oh, yeah. of yourself. It's basically, imagination. it's basically me <laughs> with <laughs> like a little bit of a Snowden mask on. Yeah. That's it. That's interesting. That's it. <laughs> That's interesting. And now the big question is, a lot of people think that you make big money on doing covers like this. How much have you received a check yet? Because well, that's, last that's, week you had not yeah, been paid. That, no, that's, that's actually really not how it works. You know, when you do an illustration for a magazine, it, it can take weeks. And, that, and that's just normal. Okay. Uh, they have like a cycle they go through. Um, and to tell the truth, I don't even know what I'm getting paid for this yet. So <laughs> uh, I, it's something that I, t I deal with with my agent. So I don't really have an exact amount. Um, I'm sure it'll be okay. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, and like you said, it's just a big really, honor. It, yes. Really, the the thing is, is that I got to do. I mean, this this is something that I know. This painting is bigger than me now. Yeah. I mean, right. it's sort of a surreal thing. I mean, I've. Cr this is probably the most famous painting I've ever done, and yeah. e maybe ever will do. I don't know. This is right. a very surreal thing. Wouldn't it be me. amazing if Pope Francis called you or sent you an autograph copy of that? Book? <laughs> <laughs> or a little note saying loved it, you know, yeah. something that would, like that. That'd be pretty cool. It would yeah. be. Yeah. It would be. Well, yeah. congrats. Keep up Thank the great you. work, Jason. Thank it's you very so nice much. To meet Chicago's very own.